And he pushed the fire button and it went off. I have some footage here I'll show you. What we're doing, we're getting their backs ready for what their brace is gonna do. I think it's very valuable to feel powerful. Susie just got home from school and I was like, um, nice outfit. Oh, okay. <laughs> Give her a go. Okay, Daisy's going to school. Frank is so sad. Say bye, Daisy. I'm gonna play cards with you after school, okay, Nino? All right, bye, Daisy, love ya. Bye. Good morning, I'm here with Ender, and he's throwing out some ideas for his birthday party. Um, so that's exciting. Um, Evie's not super excited about it. Oh, what? Ender's trying to do a math party, and Amber doesn't agree, I don't agree, Daisy doesn't agree. Ender, and so tell me what you're thinking for your birthday. I'm kind of thinking a math party. I think that's a great idea, because that's what you're into right now. Like, you have birthdays for what you're into. You like math. Tell me some ideas that you would do at a math party. Uh, I support it. I fully support it. I'm not, like, making fun or anything. I think it's a really good idea, because you love math so much. Like, EB loves... Um, Jojo Siwa, Silks, like she has birthday parties according to what they like at the moment. So Ender likes math. What ideas are you ha thinking of having at your birthday party? Well, what kind of activities? I don't know. Yeah, you do. Let's hear them. Mm -mm. I think they're good ideas. Like I think he, he thinks because Ambry and E.B. don't think they're good ideas, but E.B. is not your birthday. I know, but I'm not accepted. Okay, and he can have a math birthday. And Frank, what kind of birthday are you going to have? A car birthday? Yeah, boom. Yeah, boom, boom, birthday. Yeah. Okay, you sounds good. Say car? But Dad, our noodle's yeah. birthday wasn't very celebrated because he didn't get a cake. We gave him a cake? What are you talking about? Yeah, didn't we? Nino turned to two. Like the chamois and birthdays. Yeah. 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 In Amigo. October, huh? Amigo. Amigo. Good morning. Everything is just peachy today. <laughs> We're having a good day. I keep so I'm searching the CDC every single morning when I wake up to see if they've changed it down to a level three. Hopefully by the time this vlog even goes live, it is. But the truth of the matter is, is that we just aren't going to know until it happens. <laughs> but um, we got some more orders for bread bowls, and we are down to like six of them that are left. So by the time this vlog goes live, they're probably gonna be gone, but I think Davey has redesigned the box, and he said he might order another bunch of them. Comment below if you guys didn't get one and wanted one, and let us know if there's still an interest in them, and maybe we'll do a little bit different kit. We're thinking of adding a couple things in, so that are necessary or really helpful. So, um, just feeding the kids lunch, and I'm gonna try to get Frankie to eat a couple more bites, and then he goes down. And I just put lunch or dinner, so it's lunchtime. But I just put dinner on the Traeger. This is the best time to think about dinner, in my opinion, is at lunchtime because sometimes the easiest things for me to cook take like eight hours because I'm either throwing it in a crock pot or a Dutch oven and then in the Traeger. So what I'm doing tonight, I'm like, guys, stop barking. Frankie earlier today was playing with the control panel for Vivint and he pushed the fire button and it went off. I have some footage here I'll show you. I don't think he's gonna do that again. <laughs> I ran upstairs as fast as I could because I was down there packing boxes and he was just hysterical. I was like, did you get hurt? And he goes, no. And then I looked at the footage and I was laughing so hard because it just scared him because it was so loud. Yeah. Yeah, and what did you do? Uh, I 
You were crying, huh? Yeah. And it went, woo, woo, woo. Yeah. Uh-huh. Woo, 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 the Traeger, what I'm doing for dinner tonight is I have a boneless beef chuck roast. Oh, good job. A boneless beef chuck roast. And I am, it has to sit on like 180 grill for an hour and a half. And then you put it into a Dutch oven with carrots and potatoes and some yeah. onion. It's gonna be so good. And then you let it sit in there with and some like beef broth. And then you let it sit in the Traeger in the Dutch oven for like another five hours. Dinner's gonna be so good tonight. I love our Traeger so much. In fact, we use it so often, I think that we're interested in getting a larger one. So they have a couple sizes bigger than the one we have, and we have a huge, huge family, especially when we have other like families, like if Davy's sister comes over with her seven kids, that's nine more people. Um, we love having cookouts with the Traeger and, or barbecues. And we just need more space on it because we love entertaining and our family's already ginormous. Add one more even and it's double ginormous. But they have triggers that can handle it. So I think we're gonna invest in that. Okay, that's all I have to say for right now. I'm gonna, what I'm gonna work on the rest of the day is cleaning this house because I just need a fresh reset. Like the kids are so great about doing their zones but nothing beats a mama clean. Except for maybe hiring someone that's a mama that cleans for you, but not in the budget right now. So, <laughs> and even if it was in the budget for a while, we had a cleaner and I mean, it's a sacrifice to pay money to have someone else clean, but that I kind of just noticed that the kids were like, oh, I'll let the cleaner do it. And I was like, no, actually, you need to learn how to do this. I think it's very valuable to feel powerful and feel like I can do something that's hard. And I've noticed if we don't teach them how to do like the hard everyday little things like a batch of dishes for an eight year old or even Evie, she's six now. I've been teaching her how to do the dishes. Little things like that. If you don't teach them how to do little hard things when they're little, they don't feel confident enough to do big hard things when they're big or even little hard things when they're big. And so that's actually the biggest reason why I only have cleaners come in on very unique situations now. Um, I want my family to be able to do it. And if mama starts to get mad because it's not getting done right, that's a teaching moment. And I can sit them down and explain to them like how they're supposed to be doing it correctly and it just works that better. Exhibit one. Susie just got home from school and I was like, um, nice outfit. Literally had not seen her yet today <laughs> at all. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, let's see how many more days in a row we can do it, Susie. <laughs> but Susie says she has lacrosse today at 2.30. It's snowing outside. So hopefully they cancel it. <laughs> oh, do you yeah, want to try some? I love them. Daisy noticed that I didn't even see her today. Daisy, you walked in and said what? You're matching. And no, you snowing. said it's snowing and I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it too. Okay, anyway. exhibit B. Much better. Oh crap, it's not working anymore. I'm gonna have to do it myself. No, it doesn't look organized, but it is clean. So that is all that matters. That's about as organized as it gets. Okay guys, we just finished up um, running some errands. I've got Ambry and Zaid here. We're here. Um, we just got noticed that their custom back braces are gonna be, we're about 10 days out or two weeks out. He does some special physical therapy to kind of get them ready to wear the braces. I don't know exactly what to expect, but 
onward and upward to helping these guys out. So let's go in and check it out. Okay, so what we're doing, we're getting their backs ready for what their brace is gonna do. Um, it's opposite of what her little curve is. So it's kind of contorting. They do 12 minute breaks and, or they do 12 minutes and then a five minute break. How does it feel? Not, not fun? All right, well, that's why we do this, get you ready for the brace. It's not fun, it's working. Yes. <laughs> Susie's eating chips with his spoon. <laughs> it looks so good, it looks like a crumb. Okay, I'm glad you like those. I have more. <gasps> <laughs> it's so good. It's like so good. They're buttery, huh? I don't know. It's just so addictive. I can't stop. It. And I have this one too. No way. <laughs> yeah. Is it on? Oh. Okay. Susie says tonight the cheer practice is being Disney, so I said I have something for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe that's a little issue for something. No, you walk in like that and then you take that off, and everyone will laugh so hard. <laughs> I could you do have that. To own it, Susie. I could do that. That's a little hard to have practice on. You can wear spandex underneath. It's just to show up in. You just show up in it and then you just like have your take it off. Yeah, it's funny. I could do that. Look at Mickey. Do you want me to come in with you and drop you off and wave at everybody? They'll all take pictures. It'll be great. I <laughs> think this is the best. Mini head I was just thinking of something like ears or like is it no. stuff, but no, no, this is not. We are not playing small. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. Just took dinner off of the Traeger. Let's see what we have here. It is so tender. Falling apart. It looks delicious. I better taste it to make sure it's not poison. I've never made something in the Traeger that I didn't think was incredible. So, pot roast in the Dutch oven, in the Traeger. I'm gonna add a little salt just because I don't think I had some in there, but I should have tried it without just to see. I might need another bite just to check. Oh, it's amazing. We don't have enough. <laughs> Frank, Frank, you are the loudest baby in the world. Stop yelling, okay? Um, Susie. You guys are cheerleading, practicing in Disney themed costumes. Listen, like I Halloween? Wear the whole costume with the head, like just bring it to be funny to walk in. Yeah. She says, No, I don't think so. Have some confidence, Susie. No, it's, it's like make everyone think. It's usually just like a tank top. It's well, you're not going to cheer in it. Point. You just walk in with funny. it. Huh? Have Susie some confidence, like Susie. Do you want to see the coaches light up and be so happy? It's they will love it. Like Do ever. it, Susie, or I won't give you a ride. Anyways, you guys, I'm wearing a dress. No. No. The dress no. is not. Not funny. All right, so earlier today when I was picking up Evie from preschool, I may have accidentally scratched the car with the tree. What? And I have to go tell Davy about it. It's... I mean, I need to tell him about it. But don't tell him. I'm gonna Mom, get his reaction on camera. Hey, don't! Oh. Okay. You're the king of ruining surprises. What happened? <laughs> I may or may not have accidentally scratched Bessie today. Why? I accidentally. I was turning and there was a big tree and it scratched. I don't see it. It's not as bad as you think it. <gasps> no, come and look at it. Oh, please. Like right there. You see that way up there? Yeah. Oh. I know I the scratched mud? it. No, I did scratch it. I did. I did scratch it. Maybe it just hit the windows. Maybe it just hit the windows. Uh, oh, no, here it is. No, that's just mud. I'm still docking you. I'm docking your uh, your allowance. What? You allowance. I don't ever buy anything. What? Eating well, I'm free. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Wait, what? Yeah, what do you yeah, want to buy? Yeah. Don't say where. Yeah, what? Yeah, what? Yeah. To make up for it, you want to buy what? 